Hello everyone, this is Ross here for Xbox Gamer Reviews and today we're taking a look at Spheroids. This is developed and published by Eclipse Games. It's going to be available on the Xbox Store on the 10th of January 2017, priced at £6.49, that's $7.99. It's also an Xbox Play Anywhere title, so if you buy it on your Xbox One console, you can play it over on your PC via Windows 10, and if you purchase it on Windows 10, you can play it on your Xbox One console. Um, so yeah, let's jump into it and take a look at what it's all about. Okay, so we've got a bit of on-screen text here. I'm um, have to read it as it goes. It's auto-playing if you like. Um, so yeah, we'll pause it. All these little tutorial bits are all auto playing as well, so you don't do anything here. It's like like a cutscene. Um, well, the game should start any minute now, though. There we go. The funky music. So it's a platformer. Um, takes a bit of inspiration from games like Pang. Um, if you ever played that. As you'll see in a second, so you press and press the B button to shoot your arrows upwards to destroy the spheroids, like so. Right, so grab these coins as well. Use these coins a little bit later on to purchase upgrades. Let's grab these ones here. Um, you get areas like this where you get sort of locked in until you destroy all the spheroids in the area. Um, taking damage there. There we go. Grab that heart. We can now leave. Right, next level. Okay, right. This is the uh, upgrade machine. So we've got 65 coins to spend. Um, you can buy a shield for 25, double hook for 10, extra life for 25, and there's also some uh, some further upgrades down the bottom there, um, which cost quite a bit more. So we'll just grab some double hooks for now. So that's a yes for that. So what this lets you do is press the B button twice in succession, like that. Um, helps you out in some of the trickier situations a bit later on. You can also shoot downwards by jumping and pressing down and the B button. There's little uh, pods here as well, they're like um, checkpoints. So if you do die, you do spawn at the last one you was in. There we go. Get some of these killed quickly as we can. Some power ups as you see drop down while you're playing as well. That's so it makes time stand still that one for a few seconds. Let's get up over here. And there we go. Grab as many coins as we can. And there we go, so that is uh, the end of that area. We get a little bit of a cutscene again, telling us about some more enemies. Um, this one is where they uh, they split down into smaller enemies when you shoot them, as we'll see right now.
Right, let's go. There's some buttons here to press as well. Um, so new elements being added each time we play a uh, new area. Um, any power-ups we can purchase now. Extra life capacity. Longer time stop. Um, I really can't. We haven't got a lot of money anyway. We'll save that for now. Right, let's grab this button. Down and B. Got that one. There we go. Oh, I'll fight game then. <laughs> right, next area. Everything. Get these coins. Right, we're doing this one, so let's break one. Oh. There we go. I uh, pressed the wrong button. I <laughs> right, grabbed that extra life. Need that. Button up there we need to press. There we go. order I believe um, is it that? there we go checkpoint oh no I <laughs> thought I trapped myself in there That's a bit naughty that that TNT stayed up there. <laughs> oh, there we go. Alright, upgrades. Can we get anything this time? 90 coins to spend. Anything worth getting? Not really. Right. Oh, died. <laughs> okay. All right. Try and get him while he's uh, frozen as quickly as we can. Why well, that um, timer got stuck up there? Didn't seem to be stopping anything. All right, there we go. See where he last died as well. Dude's dead body there. That's quite funny. <laughs> right. Jump up.
there. There we go. End of the level again. Um, I think that might be it for that area. Yeah, so we finished Japan. So each area is themed after a, a country. I've got a new tool as well now, Grappling Hawk. So again, more elements of game being added to uh, to it as we go along. Um, so we can swing from a Grappling Hawk as well now. Pretty cool looking. So we're off to Brazil now. Right, let's give this place a look. Um, what can we buy? More effective shield. Confirm. Let me buy a shield. There we are. Use X to use the grappling hook. Push X. Okay, so you sort of press it and then it auto grabs. So you just swing with the left stick. I'm assuming, yeah, you jump off with the A button. Yeah, because pressing and holding X sort of raises you up. Okay. That's a bit tricky to get the hang on to start with. I'm not sure we'll get there. Whoops. I'm pressing an old net and not letting go. <laughs> right. There we go. Can we? No, don't do that. What's up here then? Just some. Uh, that little bonus area, okay. a bit big. There we go. Jump on there, yeah. Oh. Any ruined there. Uh, I didn't really ruin that then. I need to grab all these coins. Is that the end of the level? Yeah, it is. There we go. Awesome. Right then, so I'm going to leave the video, video there for today. Uh, this has been a quick preview of Spheroids out on the 10th um, of January, so go and check it out if you're interested. Don't forget, it is an Xbox Play Anywhere title. So as I said earlier on, if you buy it on Xbox, you can play it on your Windows 10 PC and vice versa. So yeah, I hope this video has given you a nice little insight into the game, what it looks like and what it plays like. And if it has, don't forget to leave a like on it. Don't forget to subscribe if you've not already done so. It does mean a lot to us. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon.